Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. This might have to be the last video that I do about summer because I am still trying to refrain from diving so hard into fall, but it is October. I think this will be like the last thing that I do for this season just so that I can really maximize the fall content that I'm gonna be putting out there. I'm gonna give it one last hurrah for you guys, embrace my summer, and then I'm diving in, I'm diving in. Upstate New York, it's about 90 degrees today. If you watched my last video, you know that the summer isn't really my motivating season. I definitely don't feel inspired when it's ungodly hot. Our house is pretty toasty because it's an upstairs apartment and we only have two window units. So it gets really hot, really, really hot. And I just can't find the desire to do anything if I'm going to be sweating the whole time. So I thought maybe today I could get a little bit of motivation by making a video just to like have a mid-year reset, you know, a midsummer reset, house refresh, and just kind of feel productive that way. So my plan for the day pretty much is to clean up, probably take some time to sit inside where it's nice and cool and do some journaling. I think I'm gonna make an end of the summer bucket list because I did see someone do that and I thought it would be a good idea just for me to not be so miserable until fall comes. Like I said, I need something motivating when it is this hot outside. So I'm gonna do a little bit of journaling, maybe make a little bucket list, and then try to end the day with some self-care. I would like to take a bath because I did just get some nice goodies for a nice self-care bath, but it is really hot, like I said, and we're going to dinner tonight with my parents, so the bath might have to be on hold, or I might just have to take a cold shower instead. <laughs> Sad. The summer bucket list is in effect. Just fun to doodle a little bit. Can you tell I'm a regular Picasso? <laughs> yeah, so these are just the things that I really wanna do before the summer's over. Tomorrow I'm doing a beach picnic, so that one will be crossed off. I wanna go kayaking at least two more times. Go camping twice and both of those are scheduled. Go to the public market because the one we have here is actually one of the best I've ever been to and I haven't even been since we've moved home. Need to support local and get some delicious fruits and veggies there. Highland Park, we're pretty famous for that here. Didn't go to the Lilac Festival this year so just thought a walk around the park would be an easy one to accomplish and also really good for the soul. Seabreeze, if you can't tell, is our amusement park. It's not the best amusement park but it is if you're from here, so we have to go. Marge's is a cocktail bar on the beach. Thrifting, that'll kind of kick off the start to fall, I think, and then I wanna finish at least one painting by September, I guess. And then, number 10, I kind of put my birthday in there as an end of summer kickoff, even though it is September 14th, so it will be fall by then in my mind, but it's a good way to end it off and check everything off my list, yeah. Sorry. I did make some fun pumpkin pancakes this morning, but I made a mess of it, so I need to clean that up.
gonna make a smoothie for lunch because we drank a lot last night, so it's time to be healthy. seriously already sweating it is so hot all I did was do some dishes and make a smoothie I'm not the best about eating healthy but last night had um, you know a few more servings of mezcal than the average girly should so I thought today I'd be a little bit healthier and not just have pizza and alcohol so made myself a little smoothie with some fresh fruit today I usually do frozen fruit but we had a lot of fresh fruit that was kind of gonna go bad soon so put a lot of fresh fruit in here and I have some peppers that I chopped up. Let's see how this tastes because it is an ugly color. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's very good. You know, I will say I am not a ranch person. I am very exclusively a blue cheese person because I am from upstate New York and represent, okay? Buffalo wings, blue cheese, if you get it any other type of way, you're wrong. But dipping bell peppers in ranch is one of the best things in the world. I stand by that. 10 out of 10. All right, next thing I gotta do Clean out the fridge. So it might be a slow sporadic day, not the most productive day that I was looking for, but I did a little bit of laundry, did some dishes, some cleaning out the fridge, and that's more than I've done any other day this week. So I'm feeling good about it. Still need some quality time with the AC unit. So I'm gonna go sit in front of that and finish up the night with a cool shower. You guessed it. Thanks for coming along with me on my chaotic semi-productive day. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Like and subscribe to this one, it helps out a lot and wish me luck with my cold shower.